Okay, everyone, this is Dennis Nayer, the Director of Research Development and Training for the New York State Association of Chiefs of Police. And right now I have the privilege of talking to Michael Neela, who is the founder of Blue Courage. Michael just gave a, an amazing presenta presentation to our membership at the uh, state conference, and he's going to talk a little bit about what Blue Courage is. So first, Mike, thank you for being here. Thank you. So first question is, can you please describe for the listeners what the main premise of Blue Courage is? Sure. Yeah, Blue, Blue Courage is an educational process, and, and notice I use the word process. It's more than just a class. It's about uh, teaching police officers approaches that will help them to not just survive this career, but to thrive in it. We all know that uh, the profession has, while as honorable and noble as it is, it comes with immense challenges. You know, we know high suicide rates, high divorce rates, high alcoholism, you know, a number of the, the physical and emotional challenges that come with policing. Well, Blue Courage is, is an educational process designed to help police officers mitigate those harmful impacts on the job. It's, it's about creating what we call um, in Blue Courage an, an enriched environment in which our police officers can spend the rest of their career and then retire, hopefully, and live a happy, healthy, resilient, uh, long life and not succumb to the challenges of this profession. So in essence, what we do is we teach them uh, both, you know, theory, practices, give them tools and processes that they can implement into their life every day that help them to manage the challenges of this profession in a much better way. In essence, you can say that Blue Courage is about two things. It's about uh, first enhancing our human capacity to do this job well, and it's also about um, readiness to do this job at the highest level possible. Blue Courage fills in the gaps that traditional police training does not do. Traditional police training, most of a police officer's career from academy to retirement is, is skill and tool training because we need to produce highly skilled police officers. But Blue Courage, while it does give you skills and tools, it more focuses on what we call the heart set and mindset of a police officer. So building that foundation that allows you to use those skills and tools in the right manner. And I just really like hearing the fact that it's – creating officers that are going to be responding the way in which we would want an officer to respond to us because their heart is in the right place and that they are in a condition to enjoy retirement once they get there, yes. and I think that's amazing. Is, is the Blue Courage training geared more toward law enforcement at the command, supervisory, or patrol level? Yeah, that's a great question. We get it all the time. Blue Courage is a leadership development course. However, we don't refer, we're not talking about the kind of traditional leadership that prepares somebody to be a sergeant, captain, and chief. We're talking about the leadership development that prepares us for life, so that prepares us to uh, live uh, effective, well-intentioned lives. That's what leadership means to me. So leadership, you know, comes in, parenting is leadership. You know, being a good spouse, there's leadership is involved. So Blue Courage is designed for all levels of the organization. And, you know, we firmly come from the belief that every police officer is a leader, regardless of your rank and title, because leadership is not a rank. Leadership is not a title. Leadership is how you conduct yourself and how you perform and how you believe and how you show up. So in that sense, leadership, Blue Courage as leadership development is for everybody in the organization, from police academy, which is where it really should be taught, all the way through to the highest levels. Now, what we do differently, however, is if I'm teaching uh, a group of line-level officers versus a group of executives like we did today, what we do is we change the teach. In other words, we're using executive level examples and language, whereas if we're teaching line level, we're using line level examples or in the academy. So what we do is we adjust the teach, but we don't adjust the content because the content works regardless of what level you're at in the organization. Thank you. Uh, following up with that is how does the Blue Courage curriculum align with officer safety and wellness as defined and described in 21st century policing? Yeah, another great question because, you know, as, as the 21st century policing task force uh, evolved and as a report got out and there were many meetings, you know, among a number of the principals and even the task force, uh, they became aware that health and wellness was really the fundamental issue. And that's the premise of Blue Courage. Blue Courage is a health and wellness class uh, workshop. We're teaching practices on health and wellness uh, for a number of reasons. One is one of the principles that we teach in Blue Courage is that it is not honorable, noble to serve others and ignore yourself. 
you know, we use the example of on an airplane, you know, when the flight attendant gives the instructions, if the oxygen mask comes down, put yours on first. Um, because that basic principle says that only if we are in a state of health and wellness can we serve at the highest capacity, and only if we are in a state of health and wellness are we able to be compassionate and empathetic and use good judgment and have discernment and do those kinds of things that, that are required of us to be at our very, very best state. So when we talk about health and wellness in Blue Courage, we run everything through the lens of what we call the four domains of what makes us human, and that's the physical, the mental, the spiritual, and the emotional. The Institute of Heart Math, which teaches resilience and the science of resilience and peak performance and optimizing performance, says that we have to have each of those four energy domains be nurtured, and maybe not at their peak, but in a state of health and wellness for us to perform at high levels. You take any one of those away, and we're not going to perform at high We're just going to survive. So Blue Courage is a very sophisticated uh, health and wellness course that takes us far beyond just the nutrition, sleep, and exercise, far beyond that to all the different domains. Yeah, and as we said earlier, I, I can think of no profession that can compare with just how draining yeah. um, all of those uh, elements can can become yeah. because of what law enforcement officers deal with day in and day out, multiple times per day. Well, and one incident can be draining, but the cumulative effect of four or five days a week, you know, how many weeks in a year and how many years are we on the job, the cumulative effect of, of that is devastating on us physically, emotionally, and in, in every one of those energy domains. So what we're teaching our police officers is first of all, how do you how do you mitigate those harmful things? With daily practices that you can you can embed, you know, sixteen second pattern interruption during a shift. You just you handle a really bad domestic, or you have to fight with somebody, you get in a pursuit, or your boss yells at you. How do you mitigate that to get rid of it so that I'm not carrying that to the next call, the next confrontation, the next, and then the day after day after day after day. So we're teaching the cops to kill that, curate emotional time and space so it isn't cumulative and build up. Well, after listening to your two-hour presentation, I'm a huge fan and a huge supporter. So how can the listeners find out more about Blue Courage and related courses? Uh, well, we have our website is the easiest source of information. It's just bluecourage.com. Uh, anybody can email me at michael at bluecourage.com. It's M-I-C-H-A-E-L at bluecourage.com. We have a wealth of information on the website. Um, if you email me, I can get it to you. Uh, we have a lot of cool things like the Daily Dose of Blue Courage, which is an email that comes in every single day that reinforces you know, the, the principles and process we're doing. It's a quote and a picture. It takes you 10 seconds to read it, but it might just, you know, give you a frame of reference for the day or start it in a day of positivity. Uh, you can access that through our website. We have podcasts on the whole issue of Warrior versus Guardian. Uh, so any of those things and our resources are on the website. Excellent. I hope all the listeners take full advantage of that. And again, thank you very much for an amazing presentation. Thank you. Thank you.